What's up guys, Sam Man back with another review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new DC Multiverse McFarlane Toys, The Suicide Squad Peacemaker. This movie is streaming right now on HBO Max or it's in theaters. So if you haven't seen it, definitely check it out. We got John Cena right here. He's playing Peacemaker who actually just steals the movie. I can't wait to see him in his own HBO Max series. Now... I mentioned this before, WB is not allowing weapons for their figures, so unfortunately we don't get to see his guns that he has in the film. We get to see his bicep guns, that's 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 what we get to see in this figure, but he comes with the sword, unfortunately. Um, we got the arm pieces to build King Shark, so I'll just need Harley Quinn, which I'll review right after this one, and then we'll be able to complete King Shark, but I'll attach the arms to the body somewhere in the video. Uh, the packaging, you got the Suicide Squad on the side. On the back, that's the card you're going to get, and also shows the... the um, uh, instructions on how to build King Shark and then right here we have the other figures from the series like I said I'll review Harley Quinn next I've already reviewed uh, Bloodsport and Polka Dot Man so watch those on my channel let's open this guy up all right guys let me show you the accessories that come with Peacemaker so you do get the collectible card again I mentioned this before I do collect these and in the back there is a bio he does come with the same type of base that they all come with and then you also get his sword right here and I don't know if I remember him having a sword in the film. Did he have a sword? Probably did. I just don't remember. I just remember him using his guns. Um, but this is a soft rubber material. You got the handle there. And then he does come with the arms for King Shark, which I'll attach uh, towards the end of the video. So let's bring out Peacemaker. Now, there is going to be an unmasked variant of him. So I'm probably going to pass on that. Same with Bloodsport. Those are going to be Walmart exclusives. But over here... You have him rocking his helmet, which looks so freaking cool. It does resemble John Cena, though. This this does really look like John Cena. Cena. Um, I like how they said it looks like he has a toilet. He's wearing a toilet. That's freaking hilarious. They say that in the film. You got his logo right over here. You have his red tight shirt, and you can see there is a lot of little detailing within the shirt, a lot of little sculpting. You got some blue right over here. There's the top of the shoulders. You got some silver. Now, the joints on this guy really bug me because, I mean, look at this. What is this? Like, this is breaking. This figure is breaking. Did you see that? Look at this. He's got like extra, he's got like three points of articulation in the, in the arm. I mean, what is that? Look, see how it's open right here? I do not like that cut right there. I really don't like those, those cuts. And then you can see the screws here. So, and then right over here on the top, you can see, you can see the openings there. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like even here too. Look at this. You can see like a gap in the in the torso area. The figure looks great, okay? It looks really good. It's just the way the articulation is cut, I'm not feeling it at all. Um, the pants, he's got like this grayish color pants or tan, I should say, with blue on there. Again, it's got some really nice sculpting in in, you know, within the pants. And then you have his black boots here. Um again, I think this is a great figure over the look of it but just there's just the articulation cuts is really bugging me about him so and that being said let's go ahead and talk about the articulation so the arms do go in and out they go forward and back he's got double jointed arms you, i guess you can say triple jointed uh he's got upper arm rotation the hand can rotate he's got a hinge there too the head rotates goes up and down tilt side to side he's got waist rotation Ab crunch, legs go in and out, forward and back, double jointed at the knee. I'm surprised it's not triple jointed. Lower leg does not rotate, but the lower foot does. He's got that whole ankle pivot and then toe articulation there. And then as far as his sword goes, he does hold on to this nicely. Um, I'm probably going to have to find some kind of like a gun for him from another figure because I want this guy to to have some kind of a weapon, not, not, not really the sword. Uh, but like I said, I mean... It's a great looking figure. The head sculpt looks on point. It does look like John Cena, you know, with him wearing this mask. It's got the build because he's a big guy. It's just the articulation cuts is what's really throwing me off on this figure. But I mean, it's still great. So right over here, we're, we got King Shark. I'm just missing the lower part of his body. And then we're going to go ahead and attach the arm. This is the left arm. So again, I hope this attaches a lot better than um, Bane. All right, looks like it does. Touch this right side. There, I clicked right in. And there you go. Look at this. He's turning out to be so freaking awesome. And then if you were to bring out Peacemaker here, you can see like the width of him. Very cool. All right, so this is the team that we have so far. I'm just missing Harley Quinn, but I will do a review on her soon. And then hopefully down the line, they give us a Rick Flag 
Captain Boomerang, um, just other figures. Let me let me throw King Shark in here. You know, we gotta we gotta put him right there. And then also um, the Rat Catcher too. There's there's a lot of characters in there that I want to see made for this line. Uh, but let me know in the comments down below, guys, what you guys think about Peacemaker. What you guys think about the line overall? And I mentioned this in the previous video with Bloodsport and Polka Dot Man. Are you picking this set up because you want the characters? Or just for the bath because he is going to be a Walmart exclusive the the King Shark but again like I mentioned in the last video if you have seen the movie you're gonna to want to pick up the, the the figures because you're gonna end up loving these characters so let me know in the comments down below let me know if you've seen the movie with non spoilers let me know who your favorite character is thumbs up the video we will see you soon later